Hey folks, Blackross here, and welcome back to Tales of Basiria. Alright then, so we met up back with Dahl in order to come up with a plan to enter into the city in order to steal our own very ship. So now, let's get started. Sleep well? Just fine, thanks. And your special concoction? Ready for deployment anytime. By the way, I never caught your name. Velvet. We'll sail together if you live, Velvet. If not, at least I know what to put on your tombstone. <laughs> You've got a sharp tongue. <laughs> I've always been that way. Right then, we're off to attack Helavis. Well, here we go. Oh, better save. It's like I haven't saved in a while. I do not want to mess this up. Meanwhile, something's up. That reminds me. Where do you think that boy who took the compass ran off to? Helavis, I'd imagine. Since Malakim are always tethered to exorcists. That means we might run into him during our attack. Are you getting squeamish about killing the boy because you feel indebted to him for healing you? No. If he gets in the way, I'll take him down. But... But? I have to remember to thank him first. <laughs> right. Does that bother you at all? No, not really. I just know that Malakim don't taste very good. Malakim don't suit your palate? I'll call that a positive. <laughs> I don't know what to make of that statement. I really don't. So we're heading head first into the building. Great. That's what we need. I'll end this quickly. I'll cut down anyone in my Okay, come here, Biggie, and get out of my way. Or never mind. Who goes there? Oh, I'm pretty sure you were expecting me. Yep, here we go. <laughs> Not even worth my time. Got them out of the way. Front we go. This should be interesting. The townspeople are gone. I was right. It's a trap. Yeah, and there's not a lot of guards. Or at least I don't see any. Oh, there they all are! Waiting for me! <laughs> the way they move is so funny. Well, look who actually showed up to rescue me! Oh, you're more of a softie than I ever gave you credit for, demon lady! You're here. You're the demon that escaped the island? What if I am? You hurt my dear Oscar. You will pay for that. Slowly. Oof! See this? Come She's and face me, that exorcist! I am honor bound to aid her. Beware her left arm! Deception! A pair of demons should be simple for you. Who wants to taste my blade next? You fiends! All exorcists form up! As I hope. See this? See this? See this? I got you! Yeah, 
This is a fight right here. Come on, I'm having so much fun fighting them. I admire your endurance, but you will regret this soon enough. Oh, she's gonna fight us? Number two. Ouch. You can't finish your own work. Coward. I won't fall for your taunts. That arm of yours is too dangerous. Besides, to dispose of demon filth, one ought to use an appropriate tool. Well, I've got tools of my own. Tools of flamestone, sulfur, and oil. Those will explode. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, it's like what? Our stores of flamestone. Boom! <laughs> Ouch! Rokuro. I'm with you. Meanwhile, all the other guards are just like, uh, do we go after her? Or hey, do we save? Th aren't you forgetting someone? What are you all doing? After them! <laughs> <laughs> Lady Teresa, the ships, the port. It's all on fire! <laughs> Orderlies, put out the fires at once! <laughs> that was fun, though. Move it! We're ready to set sail! Ouch! I won't let you escape. Never. Are we fighting her now? Yep, we are. I'm a demon. Spare me your sermons. Then you can pay with your life. Uh oh, I am out. Hurricane deception. Earth and wind. We're just trashing them! <laughs> Well, you escaped fairly easy, didn't you? Ouch! I can't afford to let it end here. Oscar. As exorcist Praetor Teresa, I give you this order. Do it, number two! <laughs> The kid's gonna blow himself up! Oh! Hello! To think you were a demon! The crybaby exorcist? I wasn't crying! Two praetors. Not looking good. Knock them back. That's an order. Knock them back, or I'll eat you. An order? <laughs> ah! Now! Uh. 
I mean, that's one way of doing it, but. Why? Why would they do such a thing to us? We're finished. Helaviz is no more. Curse you. Curse you. Such ghastly demons. The Abbey, no. Lord Artorius himself must be informed. Um. That, does, that still doesn't answer the question. Number one, why'd you threaten the kid? Number two, why did the kid help? And number three, what the fuck? I'm confused. What just happened? Ugh. Wonder where we're selling off to next. That's my like, well, that turned out better than I expected. Though we wound up with a little extra. Extra? <sighs> hmm. He looks like he'd be a scrumptious midday snack for you. A snack? She's just teasing. No. If that's an order, I accept it. What? Should we really be taking this kid along? His arts will be useful to us. And we can always get rid of him. Precisely. Malakim our tools. Use them and ditch them. Isn't that right, number two? Yes. <laughs> She's not coupled with us. It's bad enough that sh that kid reminds her of Lafi. So, yeah, this is, um, this is a little awkward. What the? The hell? Why are there so many stars? Which way do I go? You seem busy. We need more hands. We have to set our course and tie down the cargo. I've unfurled the sails. Does that not look safe to you? Sure. As long as it doesn't come loose. She. <laughs> our destination is Logris. Set a course. I'll do what I can, but this vessel really needs a bigger crew. We need to hire more men. Besides, if we keep sailing this way... Yeah? <laughs> uh... Uh, what's ahead? What's up with you? Now that was a right old conflagration. Don't think they'll be chasing after us anytime soon. You certainly didn't leave them much of a port, though. I wonder if the town will ever recover. How much did you tell them? I had just started episode two, Magilu's Fury, wherein the beautiful witch is captured and tortured by a demon most cruel! I'm starting to see why they wanted to execute you. <laughs> yeah, I wonder indeed. Velvet! How's our heading? <sighs> this is so hard to read. Actually, you're holding it wrong. It's built to function even if the ship is rolling. Huh? Velvet! The heading's fine! <laughs> Kid, what's your name? Number two. Not that. Your real name. Surely you have one. She's gonna give him one. Wanna hold it? <laughs> yeah, I... <laughs> those eyes! That's Did you hard. see those I'm eyes? You what you want. It's like the puppy dog eyes! Ordering me to answer? <sighs> right, right. You Malakim would destroy yourselves as long as it was an order, wouldn't you? That is our purpose. You really are tools. 
In that case, keep your mouth shut. <laughs> What now? Oh no. Cannon fire astern. Pirates. That flag. It's got to be Eifried's pirate crew. They've got a bead on us, folks. And in case you hadn't noticed, we aren't really equipped for sea combat. <sighs> well, there goes our supplies. To land then. We can fight them there. Uh, it's like, where are you going to land? Oh, never mind. I thought for a second, it's like, we're half in the middle of the sea! Never mind, we're actually out to land. Huh. Well, look at that. They really are a bunch of demons. That works in our favor. The you know fuck when we pick kind of pirate are you? Of a death wish. You're in trouble now that we're on land. Wipe them out, number two. That's an order. Whoa there. We're not the one you'll be fighting. Who then? Uh, hello. It'll be me. <laughs> A Moloch? No, I'm the Reaper. I like that! What is this guy? A Moloch pirate? A sword, twin blades, and paper. No pendulum that I can see. How's that? Hold up! You're too slow! Got you! How's that? Deception! Too slow! Hold up! Hurricane! One two! Hurricane! Let's go! How's that? Deception! See this? Let's go! How's that? No escape! Deception! Deception! Hurricane! Not good! <laughs> so far, so good! You passed the test. Join us. I'm sorry, what? Well, aren't you the impudent one? Says the demon who torched Televis. <laughs> you knew about that? I hope you realize we're doing you a favor. If you'd stayed on that course, you would have smashed right up against the gate of Vortigern. You guys are headed for Midgand, aren't you? That means you're gonna have to go through the Narrows up ahead. But the Kingdom has a massive fortress there built to defend them, with a tremendous gate. A fortress. If this is true, we're in your debt. We desire to pass through as well, but we lack the strength. I propose we form a partnership. I'd be a fool to blindly trust the words of a pirate. Do you really want to see the gate for yourself? We won't stop you. We'll even throw you a nice funeral if you like. What? We're allowed to refuse? Your business is your business, and ours is ours. There's nothing more to say. But first mate! Y you can't go alone! We'll all come with you! You'd only get in the way. Stick to the plan, and focus on your duties aboard the Von Eltia. One, isn't he? Also, didn't we get a new outfit? It looked like we did. <laughs> a pirate uh, eye patch. Okay. Okay, for a second there, I thought we got a new pirate uh, outfit or something. Oh, now that's messed up. 
Uh, okay. I'm fine. Uh, nah. <laughs> I just don't get me wrong, but I don't mind that curl. That that that's okay. Uh, <laughs> this game is giving me way too much freedom right now. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Ah, oh, we got some stuff to look at. Okay. Oh gosh, I'm gonna lose my shit. Tragically, your favorite witch is neither a sailor nor a warrior. All she can really do is look on. No argument there. Is the gate of Vortigern really something that impressive, Dial? They've got a fortress and a patrolling fleet. But the gates is the real show. Even a battleship couldn't blast its way through that thing. Is there no sea route that avoids the Narrows? There is, so to speak. But it's a long way out into the open sea. We just end up shipwrecked. Heh. <laughs> uh, so in other words, we're going to be working with the pirates before long. And what are you folks planning anyway? Like I said, we're getting through that gate. If you're not helping us, then the conversation's over. Is it possible to get through? If the first mate says he'll do it, he'll do it. You sure put a lot of faith in him. He's a Moloch, isn't he? That doesn't matter. He's got the captain's blessing, and that's enough for us. Couldn't you ignore the Narrows and just sail around? Not now. We lost both our compass and several of our crew in an earlier attack. Compass? Huh. But in the end, we're pirates. If someone blocks our way, we can't just fall back. Then that's what makes a pirate, huh? The pirates share our goal. I don't think we have any choice but to band together. True enough. If forward lies destruction, and backward lies doom, sideways is your only option! And yet, you don't feel like helping out. I sure don't. Good. <laughs> well, she's on it. Moloch isn't all he seems. Who knows what's up his sleeves? The kid's a Moloch, too. Hey, boy, you sense anything? Hmm. <sighs> We both have ulterior motives. In any case, let's go after him. Yep, that's what we're fixing to do. What's up, bud? I know you probably won't listen to me, but you shouldn't get involved with Ifrit's pirates. Ifrit is the fiercest, most villainous pirate in all the seas. Every sailor trembles at his name. For a demon, you're pretty wimpy. Demon or not, scary is scary. So this Ifrit is that tough? You bet. Rumor has it he's an unrepentant troublemaker and is as strong as an ogre. His gang are all fearless, wild rogues. They've turned the tables on the Royal Navy time and time again. And best of all is their ship, the Von Eltia. She's a legend that's traveled to distant lands across the sea. Nice. Sounds like I'd get along with them just fine. <laughs> you seem to know an awful lot about them yourself. Well, it's just that every sailor dreams of being as wild and free as Eifried and his pirate crew. I guess. Hey, I can dream, can't I? Demon or human or even lizard, we all got our fantasies. I guess. Depends on how you look at it. <laughs> Alright. Might as well get ready and save, and then in the next video... Oh, we have a chest! I see what's in it. Earth ring. Okay. Okay, I think that's all we can get for the time being. Up. Come on. I get too hasty with these things. It's like the yes needs to be here and the no needs to be here. Unless the uh, cursor thing is stripped on the no. Oh well. Anyway though, I'll see you in the next video. Until then, this is Blackcross signing off. Take care guys.